Heya! It's Whimsy and we're back today with a new episode of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We are going to do odd jobs in Nibelheim and uh, Proto Relics as well and then we'll take Sid High Wings um, plane and we'll go back to the gold saucer. I think that's what we're gonna do today. So yeah, let's jump into it. Let's go. Here we go. So off camera, I did all the combat simulator stuff I could do, and I did perfect score for Eric's team. And then I was like, "Oh, the the dude is here. Let's go see him." But then it was the last song apparently, and there was like a cutscene and such and such. I was like, "Oh no 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 no! I don't want to see that." So I skipped. And I wanted to quit the game and come back later with you guys on camera. And I still got the trophy for that, which was... I don't actually remember. So, um, yeah, we're not gonna get the trophy, but I didn't see the cutscene and everything. So we can do it again now. Also, there was a patch. Share a performance with there was me? a patch. Um, today. So I don't know. All the more pleasing when played on the piano. Don't know what Thank it did. you for sharing such joy with the world. So you've mastered all of our pieces. From well what I understood, it, there was the. On behalf um... of the association, I offer you our deepest gratitude and uh, this bug token with, of our uh, chapter 12, actually. I'd like so you to have this too. An expression uh, here we go. Of my own personal. So apparently, yeah, there was a bug with a with a quest in uh, chapter 12, so it's perfect for us. But apart from that, I don't know um, what At else. A young age. I lost my sense of sight, da, 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 da. and so sounds became my window to the world. The chirping of birds, the rustling of leaves, the trickling of rain, Damn. each a melody unto itself, each a ray of light that pierced the darkness and brought color to the pitch black world in which I had come to live. By playing the piano, I learned to speak from the heart in the language of music, to share my own song. light with the world. And I hope that I may continue sharing that light, spreading the joy of music to all who will listen. Amazing. So we got binding and healing materials, <sighs> I think. Written on this page is the music that illuminates my world. I've no doubt that in time you will learn to <gasps> A new... <laughs> oh, nice. It is May that song. May you grace nice. the libraries with your dexterous touch and weave your enchanting melody for many years to come. Inspired by Cloud and Tifa's performances, everything you feel also have decided to try their hands at tickling the ivory so you can change character. Oh, it's a wonderful day for a melody. Where there is music and a piano on which to play, there too is a... The piano is here for you. <gasps> this is where we care. I'm excited. Business. Let's go see. Checkups, treatments. So yeah, I you got the trophy last time, you know, we didn't get it this time, but... um. Shut up, I know. Oh my god. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> I know. Okay. Yes. Perfect, let's go. At num at level three. <laughs> She's so much smaller. Oh good lord. I'm 
missing. Let up good. What the fuck? Oh, we got an A. That's not too bad. <laughs> That was crazy! Let's do it again. Just once. But the parts where it's like super fast, holy! It's not that bad, but... Holy. When you start missing, it's uh, it's the end of the world. Okay, let's uh, let's quit. We can definitely do it, but uh, not not right now. <laughs> we still got an A. It's fine. Okay, okay. I was like, how are they going to? I'm not sure why that is myself. Shut up. Maybe it's to mark ones with different symptoms. <laughs> if you're here to visit someone, hey, I got an A. Well, there is music and a piano on which Don't you to oh, give it's me a wonderful day something. for a melody. Yeah, Wouldn't you agree? Maybe I have to do perfect and then I unlock something else. Huh? It'll we be never okay. know. It'll be okay. All right, let's do Proto Relic. Why not? It's gonna be another mini game, probably. Or fighting off fiends. You know, something like that. Oops. Aha! Uh -huh. Rule figures are shambling towards some unknown destination. Find out what exactly it is. Should you wish to give the group a nudge in the right direction, you can push them from behind with L2. Are just trailing them? You heard Chagley. That's the plan. At least till they get to wherever they're going. <laughs> Getting sleepy, are we? With how slow they walk, who wouldn't? Can run on ahead and play scout. But stay where we can see you. <sighs> Ever since we left the veil, never should have dropped the intellectual shtick. Not a fetch slow as fuck quest, please. Faster. going they're all going this way what do you mean turn around wait 
Can these guys do anything? Oh. Oh. Remember? It was never in doubt. Not to be a downer, but there's no way we can save him from everything. We'll do what we can. Hey, so what kind of stuff do you think they're thinking about? The black robes? I don't know. The proto relic, maybe? I doubt they're lucid enough to even know what they're doing. Probably better that way. Is Roche in there? True. I'll bet they've seen some things. Reduced to their instincts. Like animals. Man. Screw Shinra. Damn right. At least if there was a lot of banter, it would be fine, but um. Right now it's just uh. I'm not very patient. You know. Maybe they go in there, so it's not too bad. What's that? A Shinra testing facility. They were looking into Mako Extraction's effects on the region's water supply. And? And they found that there were none. Or so the official statement claimed. Oh, no need to worry then. If I may put your minds at ease, both Nibelheim's water tower and pipe network utilized filtration devices that were state-of-the-art for the time. Furthermore, there was no evidence that water quality was impacted by the reactor. The filters likely mitigated any deleterious effects. Well, I grew up drinking that water. Mm, that certainly explains mm -hmm. a lot. Sure those filters worked? You tell me. <laughs> okay, the banter is, is fine. After all. Uh... Help them proceed. Can we... I don't know what these do. The choco grass. I uh, have not a single clue. Okay. How do I help them go through? I thought I could reach from from uh, here, but maybe not. Come on. <laughs> um. anything earlier what do you mean game <laughs> okay um stop running off on your own already heads up what are those <laughs> i got you now. Galvanize a regular interval, doing enough damage, then we'll calm them down and pressure them. It's on you. Yeah, whatever. Do it. Here I go. You need to chill. Here I go. This calls for more Yuffie. Kill now. Run like a chocobo? Um, um. Abra, 
Magical shield that fi fires petrifying shots when struck by enemy attacks. Oh, that's new. Good to go. Oh, you got this. I got this. Try this. There we go. Easy. Easy. Is that our proto magic? Part of one, looks like. Fragment elf. Uh -huh. uh, Ian must have ingested the fragment by mistake. Ew. Little wonder I was unable to locate it. <laughs> I suspect other creatures are in possession of the remainder. So what now? Hmm. Oh. Your hooded friends may well lead us to other fragments. Whoa there. Okay. Mm. Huh. Hey, you notice? Only some of them have number tags. Yeah. I knew. Based on what I've seen in Evilheim, victims of Mako poisoning and subjects of Shinra experiments make up the majority of their number. The presence or lack of tattoos could be a clue. No one should be marked like cattle. No one. No. Because he was as well. Through real. He lets himself be petted now that the mask is down. I ask that you accompany them to their objective. They may lead us to yet another fragment. All right. Let's go slowly. Can I just go or do I have to follow them? Okay, there's gonna be another group. All right. Right here. Hey, yo! Found him! Where do you think these ones are off to? My guess? The Proto Relic. Maybe I can just... Just go a bit faster than them. Ah, <gasps> they're not moving. I gotta say, this is really bumming me out. <laughs> what is? These black robes. They all smell the same, more or less. Because of the Mako, you think? Could be, but I doubt it. Their scent is... I don't know... heavier? To me, a person's scent is one of their most defining features. But all these guys smell almost identical. Hey... What do I smell like? You smell like you. Simple as that. You already Can asked me? him that. Rotten eggs or something? He doesn't say anything. Uh, you smell like that show. What is this one? guys, you must be I don't think I've heard the song before, like the yeah. melody. All that blood's <laughs> gotta be stifling. <laughs> oh, it is. Trust and believe. Hotter than a friggin' oven. I still can't believe yeah, they managed she... to cross the desert in those getups. She has Pretty the Mughal attire. Some did. Not all. We ran into a bunch before you joined, Yuffie. And Midgar? 
I saw my fair share when I was there too. Never came across them before that though. Now that I think about it. Live next to one for a bit. I'm uh, falling asleep. I'm sorry. <laughs> Aha! All right. Here we go. Yeah, he has that. Uh, <laughs> what do you think they're pointing back at? Back in Corral, North Corral. There's a submarine dock beneath the harbor. Maybe that. There is. I bet you that's where we'll find the proto relic. Oh, I see. Make <laughs> us go and fish it out. Simplest way inside would be by sea. Then Selena's got us covered.
so I think we're in the right way. We just need to use our chocobo here. And then we can come here. Yeah. Don't know if I missed something on the other side, but whatever. Oh, nice. It's the same type of uh, enemy. Why did it make it sound like a, a monkey? It's like a mix. <laughs> I'm not Take the lead. About damn time. <laughs> and Sephiroth are related somehow. Yep. Like, connected on some really weird, deep level. Genova cells. Right. Seems so. Seems so? I don't have proof, uh, no, no, no. just a hunch. But the more I see, the more I know I'm right. Just one more reason why we gotta put a stop to that crazy bastard. <laughs> That's me with the entire game. Oh, uh... I don't I have proof, startling. just a hunch. I simply wanted <laughs> to inform theory. you that I've located more rogue individuals. Copy. Send us the coordinates. Of course. Right away. Anything? I don't think so. Let's go here. Walk. Ta oh, gee. All right. There. <laughs> so much fun. There they are. Something's not right. Oh no. Here we go. They're gonna merge. Oh, uh, here we go. Shit. That'll do. It's all I forgot. 
Oh, while deer casting spell. Yeah. Deal with that. Guess it's my turn. It hurts. Don't. <laughs> Bring it home. I'm your one-stop covering shop. How do you like this? Go forth and kick butt, you see. Do me proud. Hang back. Ready? On it. <laughs> Let me see if she does twice. She does twice the the comments. That's crazy. When she has doppelganger. Take the lead. Here come You're gonna get what's coming to you. This team is so good. What could his experiments be doing in a place like this? Unless no. Well now, this I did not expect, my precious specimens, and you, Chadley, model number CDA-6, was we... it, or seven, perhaps? One, two, three, four, five, six. Aha! Yes, lucky number seven. You and your brothers are just full of surprises, aren't you? What? Another chat. Don't be shy now. Open up and let me see what makes you tick. There's a good boy. Is it the original <laughs> Chadley? Or... What is it? Oh Jesus. Nothing. I'm fine. It is our Chadley. <gasps> it seems our roped friends are on the move again. You'd best follow closely behind. I would hate for any of them to run afoul of one of Hojo's experiments. How? Please. How did he have that camera thing? On on Chadley from Cloud's point of view, and then on Red's from I don't know whose point of view, and then on Cloud from Red's point of view. Like how? I don't get it. What the fuck? Oh, okay, I yeah, I don't need I don't need. Thank you. gonna take forever I don't understand what I just saw I would have said ah it's Kate Sith but no it was it was like a camera on like at the same height as Cloud and then at the same height as Chad Lee and can Hojo see through our own eyes like do we have like a chip inside of us or something? Like I'm... I don't know. I'm confused. Thank you! Well, what are you doing? Huh? I can't even push them. What? Do I not... I don't have to follow them specifically? Jesus. <laughs> okay. Now! Oh, she wasn't. Uh, yeah. 
Here it comes. Don't overdo it. Guess it's my turn. Don't look now, but it's about to get real. War on the Leave it to me. I guess we just need to go. I'm not sure. Hey, that group from before. Where'd they go? Killed by fiends, maybe. Or forced to fuse with them. Kojo's dead. Here. Okay, I thought I was supposed to follow the others, but uh... I'm a bit confused by this quest. <laughs> I think I'm too tired today. <laughs> I'm like... Huh? Come on! Let's go! It's number three, this one. Oh, sorry. pushing them for fun <laughs> it's not even used in the quest you don't have to push them like it's completely useless they they still have the ai to go the right way <laughs> mm, just like in Nibelheim with uh, with Sephiroth I haven't used that mechanic of valves ever since the first chapter of the game. Kind of interesting when you think about that. the arrows okay oh shit this one is gonna move something Yeah. Fuck. I would have been okay if I had, uh, I had not... <laughs> if I had done the second one first. I thought, I thought the... All the way to the right would move the middle as well. And then I would, I would be okay. But no, it's not how it ended up being. It was easier than I thought. Beastie! 
Ready. Twelve o'clock. Oh, gee. <laughs> what is this? In a lighthouse. When the HP gets low, however, it will cast mana shield, running physical attacks ineffective. Hitting is high with physical attacks will deal a large amount of damage. Uh, light. Keep it together. Need my help, do you? One shot at a time. Suck on me! Gotta love you! Kiss my ass! You got this! I'm your one stop club ring shop! Lightning? This for a smite! Hit! 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 Sonic Boom. I'm unstoppable. Uh, shooting star. How about you show Let's us what you got? Your mind. Here I go. Infinity is so and... Keep it up. Say your prayer. Oh. Ninja Caribbean. Timer. Oh, you're gonna Woo! Me. That was so cool! Level up! Speed up, material improve, nice. That was new, this, uh, this, um... Barrett and Yuffie, uh, synergy ability. I don't think I had used it before. I did that off camera, um, um, upgrading my folios and everything. I forgot to say. Did they multiply? <sighs> Oh shit, that's uh. Yeah! I forgot his name, but. B b something. Oh! Broden? Broden! Thank you. Uh, Broden! Hey! Snap out Damn. of Damn! Yeah, he was starting Wait, to become. The guy from Calm? Yeah. Is he Mako poisoned? It's Genova Sales! No. He's a former soldier. He calls. To me. Damn, that's sad. I must answer. The... The reunion. It's time. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's from Remake. Oh, <gasps> glad. Do you think he was getting treatment in Nibelheim too? He's almost following them. You good? The music is so good. Woo! Huh. I found another gathering of these individuals. The largest yet. It would appear that they're headed for the coastline. Do you think you could investigate for me? Holy. Will do. Man, I knew it was gonna it's happen, time. but time we checked it out. Still makes it um, sad, you know. For Broden, I forgot his name in the moment, but I knew it was him. I recognized him instantly with his hair and everything. Also, there was one in Ah uh, Junan. Uh, when we were trying to get the 7th infantry, you know, for the parade, there was um, a man uh, that was selling stuff that also was being, like, sick and, um, and all that, you know, but Cloud is not sick. He doesn't, like, <laughs> or anything like that. So I don't know what to make of that, like, does that mean he's not currently getting de degrading, degraded, degradation? Uh, what in the, what are they doing? 
trying to cross the water. Come on. Oh boy. Yeah, maybe is he's not getting degradation. But he still has that Why? Genova call, you know? That's what I think, but I don't know. They're gonna drown. I mean, they might make it. Maybe. Guys are nothing if not tenacious. Where are they even trying to go? That island. That's where they're being called. What? How do you know that? Because he's being called too. I... Uh... Got a feeling, is all. That's good enough for me. It's not good. Let's check it out. Okay, they're not actually going. Come on. AI works. They're like, uh, you know, those those fishes in the ocean that somehow all follow each other. You know, the very small ones. What are they called? I forget. I actually, I don't think I know in English. <laughs> We should probably rest, yeah. That would be a good idea. I have 17 cushions. I never use them. I hear a music gallery. We are music lovers. It was written there. Hmm. It looks like the uh, observatory. Cus Cosmic Cosmetol. Co <laughs> I <laughs> forget how it's called. Where uh, Bugenhagen is. The planetology thing. Anyways, you guys know what I mean. So I think we're going there. Thank you to the devs for making it easy to see. With the little green leaves. I like that. Whew. What is that? armor somehow linked to Genova? Oh boy. Of armor, oh my god! What? Whoa, what? Is a wayward soul is all yours. Ah, uh, separate. What the heck is going on? Summon my churls! How dare you! For this outrage, I demand satisfaction. All right. No problem. <laughs> no, I know I cannot escape. No way. No way Never I can't again. escape. Best do it right. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> I tried it. Here we go. Ah, 
shit. Oh, oh I didn't mean to try this. Shit. It's on now. I meant to do that. Here we go. Okay. Uh yeah. Let's do this. Braver. And do fire ninjas, please. Anything to do with this, I don't know. And Sephiroth Find by... me the black materia cloud. You suck. <laughs> I'm waiting, Cloud. So Chadley is being tortured by the ends of Ojo as we speak, so... Oh, here we go. So many questions. <laughs> will be in our possession in no time. Right. Yeah. We have to find it. We and still soon. have two to do in uh, uh, Gold South. Well, uh, Coral region? The desert, anyway. What the frick? I genuinely have so many questions. Oh, that's a uh, Billy. Huh? Cloud? Yeah. Billy? What are you doing out here? Um, I haven't had much luck at the racetrack lately. Not the good kind, that's for sure. Hmm. So I came here to train. Train? Here? You don't know where you are? This is the home of the Chocobo Sage, a living legend. Surely you've heard of the man. <laughs> Did someone say living legend? 
I need that chocobo onesie. Okay, I need it. <sighs> I am now. Thought I was a goner. Huh? Mind telling me who you are? I don't get that many me visitors out here bit. in the boonies. Uh, this is Cloud. He's a jockey for Gramps' ranch. Oh, he is, huh? Perfect. You racist? Billy here needs some help. You can pick up the poor boy's slack. There's this big race at the saucer, <gasps> the Gold Cup, and it's coming up soon. I'm we going there. Get in on that. So I came here Perfect. to bone up. I'm learning all sorts of stuff. See? Hey, tell me you're not buying this choco dung. <laughs> Picking garbage out of a pool isn't training. It's manual labor. You see it too, right? It is pretty weird. It ends up a sage. It is pretty weird. <laughs> so weird. Come on, he's just jerking you around. I suppose I haven't done much to pick up after him. If you can flap your gums, you can move your gams. Now get on back to your training. Sorry. As for you, I know just the thing. One of my chocobos ran off when we put her out to pasture. Need you to find her. Bring her back. Is You're it asking me? The one I already her name have. Is Selena. Yeah, I have her. Ain't your normal chocobo neither. Loves the ocean more than home. The way she makes rolling waves look like solid ground. No wonder she thinks she's the bee's knees. The bee's knees. Please, Cloud, would you mind? Just I think already of it as a favor did for that me? like a long You've got time a gift ago. For wrangling the wild ones. The bird that runs on water? I already found him. There you are, Selena. Mm -hmm. Well, I underestimated ya. Takes real skill to tame this girl. Skills like those of... Hold on. I know this. I do. Why can't I remember? Oh, damn it! This is gonna bother me all day. That's me all the time. You know. In English. Oh. <laughs> Aha! There we go! It was Sam and Will! What? They were far and away my best disciples. As I was Is saying, Will the, you Cloud, his father? You may well become as talented a trainer Maybe as his father one day. and then Sam. They were best <laughs> Did friends. I hear you right? Sam? You gotta tell me everything you know about him. You're gonna give me whiplash, son! <laughs> the Sam guy you taught. You mean Chocobo Sam out of Midgar? I do, but why do you want to know? Because me and him, we got history. You see? Yeah, okay. I'm Will's son. Well, don't that beat all. I'll never forget those two. They had such a powerful passion. And Probably an eagerness friends. to learn, too. So what happened? Everything they did was for the birds. That's not the Sam I know. Sam's a demon. He led my parents to an early grave. Got them hooked on gambling. Pushed them to rack up tons of debt. And then... Eh, that don't sound like him to me. You sure you ain't got your Sams mixed up? It's a common name, you know. <laughs> Only one Sam in this business. I swore that I'd humiliate him by winning the gold cup. Destroy his reputation. Then I'd at least have some kind of revenge for what that bastard did to my parents. Hmm. Now that that's out of your system, back to it. Excuse me? You heard me. Thought you came out here to learn about chocobos, not to get revenge. Uh... Cloud, for your next task, I'll need you to take Selena and gather choco grass. Oh, I have a lot of it. so happens to grow above bodies of water. You kidding me? This fossil's trying to get us to do his dirty work again? <laughs> I love how Yuffie is part of most quests. I don't know if it's because I always have her in my party. Like, in my party selection. Choco grass is a genuine panacea. I kid you not. It'll cure whatever ails wow. you. And then some. And once I am cured... Maybe I'll be inclined to share more stories about the good old days. <sighs> He's obviously full of it. If not for him, but yeah, I don't think so. I think it's cryptid it like this. Me. I need to With know what happened feet. to my dad. <sighs> How many we got already? Okay. 
When I said it grows above water, I meant above. It's called the floating flower, because it grows in the air. But with an ocean chocobo, you can harvest the stuff with ease. 30 tufts ought to do. I was just saying that Best I didn't know it, Cloud. the you don't usage want my death on your hands, do of you? that earlier. <laughs> no, I guess we do know. Sage is going to be real pleased. Oh, welcome back. Get any choco grass? Sage oh, is going to be a real at, pleased. At the bottom, I need so cute. This is so cute! The water is disgusting though. Cloud, get out of there. I'm gonna get poisoned. Oh! You get your hands on that choco grass! Ask for info. I have 30. Some folks also call it the. They don't mean it metaphorically. Makes it hard to get to with. Well, well. If it ain't my beloved choco grass. I don't know how, how many he this wanted. This stuff can be one hell of a hassle But I had 30. Thank goodness I had you to get it for me. Okay, so what are you gonna do with it? <laughs> I suppose you've earned the right to know. First, I take this fluff, mix it with some chocobo feathers, and let it ferment. Once it's dry, I boil it all down. Then I squeeze it all out and voila! Why, my why is she choco tincture. imitating That's him? Some kind of magic medicine? Oh no, just a little fun. This wrinkly, cheeky old. <laughs> Speaking of grass, if you've got some extra tufts on hand, would you mind sharing them with my assistant at the shop? I promise I'll make it worth your while. Please tell me about my father. Hold your chocobo, son. There's still one thing you need to do for me first. What a surprise. This geezer isn't gonna tell you Jack. Face it, kid. You got a lot of nerve. Casting aspersions. After all the wisdom I've shared. All the what now? Hmm. So you haven't realized you've been training this whole time? Tracking down Selena forced you to get in touch with a chocobo's feelings. I already did all, and all that before that I met you. And all that running across dude. the water you did helped hone your sense of balance and your bird handling. Key skills for any aspiring jockey. What do you say, Cloud? Bet you feel like a real choco pro by now. Can't say I do. Sounds to me like you need more training. Reckon we ought to add one more item to your regimen. Think of it as a final trial of sorts. What? Oh, give me a break. Don't go changing the subject here, Gramps. We're not doing your stupid trial. No, it's fine. I'll do it. Then it's settled. I'll be your opponent. Oh. And dear Selena will be your steed. If Cloud wins, does that mean you'll finally tell me about my dad? You've got a deal. But know that I'm I won't sure. be pulling any punches out there. When you're ready, give me a holler and we can hit the track. My dude. Choco grass collector. You got any choco grass for me? Now how about plumes? Oh boy. Whoa. That looks insane. Six stars. Goddamn. 50 tufts cleansing materia. Oh, you get a gala horn at 45. And that's a weapon for Kate. I know the sage is a bit of a handful, but stick Wait, with so it. Wait, so I already okay? delivered. It'll all pay off in the end. I promise. You I got any choco? Now how about plumes? I already delivered thirty, so only fifteen Good luck more. Out there. I would have the weapon. Oh. Level boost. Why not like elemental? <laughs> huh? 
Why not? Let me see the new uh, G. This one is so cute, I can't get over it. That's kind of cool. <laughs> Looking so fancy. I'm ready. You prepared to undertake Beat the Chocobo Sage, sure. No problem. Oh okay. Yeah, I think it was like this, something like this. I don't know why it didn't keep for some reason my uh the one from my my gear set from the gold saucer that I've always won with. But it was not with this chocobo, so that might be why. Let's go. How do we play again? Uh, fuck, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot! Okay. Shit, I shouldn't have done that. Fuck, fuck, fuck! No! No! That was bad. That was super bad. It's fine. The Choco Bubble is new. I didn't have that before. Here we go. That's better. Oh shit. feathers that was one hell of a performance oh hell yeah if i didn't know better i'd say this wasn't your first rodeo surprise well mm -hmm. shoot you got me good i and was once rusty, you start though. tearing up the track out there the racing world will blame me for letting you loose a promise is a promise sir please tell me more about my dad and uncle sam hmm all right then what do you want to know When were they here? Let's see. They couldn't have been much older than you are now. The two of them came and asked me to take them under my wing. Turned them down, seeing as I'd already retired. But they hung around the grounds anyway. 
Since they had nothing better to do, I put them to work. And that's how it all began. What were they doing here? Well, wasn't nothing out of the ordinary, I'd say. Ran some errands, did some repairs, helped around the house. You know, your standard training regimen. And in their downtime, they took it upon themselves to dig through my library, learning about chocobos and how to handle them. Came to differing conclusions. They used to argue something fierce. Where are the two of them like? I can't say the two of them got on terribly well. Oh, okay. I figured. Will and Sam had mighty strong opinions about how to best raise chocobos, and it drove them to fight with their words and with their fists. That said, only reason those two fought as hard as they did is because they both cared deeply about the cause. As far as passion is concerned, the two of them were birds of a feather. Hmm, how you feel now? Managed to sort out the mess inside? Uh, uh, what do you mean? When we first met, I saw the way your eyes were brimming with anger. I knew right then and there that what you needed wasn't teaching or training. What you needed was time. Time to look deep inside yourself and clear out all the wickedness and spite that have been haunting your heart. Which is why you had him clean out the pool? <clears throat> Exactly. The pool is clean now. I don't know Looks what good. happened to your father after he left this place. And I can understand why you'd want to beat old Sam in a race. Few things feel better than sticking it to someone who did you wrong. But that being said, you should never use your birds as tools for revenge. Mm -hmm. Ask yourself, why did I decide to start raising chocobos? I guess... I guess it's because I saw how happy those birds made my mom and dad. How they'd smile. The chocobos brought us a lot of fun. And brought us together as a family. I guess that's why. And Good they're enough. cute. The why is important. They're also really cute So don't really forget yours. I reckon Sam's got his eyes on the gold cup. Keep yours unclouded by hatred. I definitely choco ride. Sir. I'm just saying. Thanks for everything. I would have a chocolate. I'm gonna head back to the saucer. Make sure our birds are ready for the big race. Don't worry about putting your name in. I'll take care of it. All you need to do is show up and win. Thanks for everything. I'm gonna head back to the saucer. Make sure our birds... Don't worry about putting your name in. I'll take care of it. All you need to do is show up and win. There's still lots I'd like to know about my parents. Lots more I'd like to know about my Uncle Sam, too. Maybe winning that race will give me a chance to ask him myself. There's still lots I'd like to... Maybe winning that race will give me a chance... No losing to anyone else, you hear? <laughs> Can't have you dragging my good name through the mud. <laughs> now that I have that choco grass, should start me... No losing to anyone else, you hear? Can't have you dragging my good name choco, through the mud. Choco, choco, choco. Oh my God, Baron! <laughs> he went so deep. I don't know. It was like it was crazy. <laughs> All right, so we could always do this later. Uh, we're going to continue the main story for now. In response to last night's illegal broadcast by the SRC, President Rufus Shinra held an emergency press conference this morning. Hey! In it, the president announced... Stood up? Nope. Waiting on you folks. Something I wanted to ask. About your mother. Her name's Afalna, right? How the fuck Maybe. do you know that? So what? That sounds like a yes to me. I called it the second I saw you. You knew Boy, her? Am I ever glad I sent up smoke? Tell me, how's she doing? Good? No. She's dead. <clears throat> You know, 
The whole reason I joined Shinra was to become a pilot. But I wound up as a gopher for some lazy grease monkeys. Had me running around HQ fixing lights and whatnot. One time, though, I came across a pretty young thing with a little girl in her Okay, arms. it's not our father or something? Like, I would have that flipped. Was you, wasn't it? Probably. <laughs> you were knee-high to a tonberry. Mm -hmm. And I was what? Called a smogger, I'd wager. <laughs> Did he help them escape? But damn. No longer with us. That's a crying shame. Truly. Hey, Missy. It's Aerith. Aerith. Is there anything I can do for you? I want to help. What? Why? I was just trying to do right by you. <laughs> Flying us around will be more than plenty. Thanks. What's the then story again, there? If you're just dying to help, you could take us to <laughs> the salsa for free. For free? free? It's fine. We'll pay. Now it's on me. Did he help you them get escape the saucer, or just something? Give me a holler. Well, yeah, let's go. Hey, good to go. I mean, we can come back, right? Let me let me just save, just in case. I'm kind of scared. Hey, good to go. Yes. Let's get a move on then. I mean, I don't see why we can't come back and <laughs> get the <laughs> megaphone. <laughs> uh -huh. Do you know Kate Sith? Hmm? Huh. An eight? Oh! What? <laughs> okay. Excuse me? <laughs> you said that Sephiroth is your foe. I have a history with him. Oh. Unfinished business. Hmm? He bothering you? Want me to give him the boot? Try to screw us over, and you're a dead man. Yeah, because he said unfinished business. That's not necessarily negative, you know? Please, uh, take a seat. Damn, he's coming with us. Can we have him in our party? Do you think you can manage eight? Ain't gonna lie. That's a tall order for most pilots. <sighs> Lucky for you, I ain't most pilots. <laughs> Tiny Bronco. Bronco. Vincent decided to not go to sleep and instead follow us. Crazy. Hey, Sid. I was wondering, could you tell me a little more about my mom? Sure. I was greener than Mako when I met a fauna. She took my heart for a spin. Mm -hmm. Not you, Sid. Aerith. Yeah? What happened to your mother? She get sick? Doctors always said she had a weak constitution, and trying to escape didn't help. I think she just pushed really? herself too hard, all so that I could be free. I'm sorry. At least she went out on her own terms. Did she? Even if she didn't, you should honor her memory by enjoying the life she gave you. Yeah. Thanks. God hey, damn. don't know if y'all heard. Wu Tai's finally made a move against Shinra. Might be war. And as Midgar's been bombed to hell and back, Shinra's gotta be on the ropes. <laughs> war isn't worth celebrating. Mm. Ever. I agree. Exactly. This'll affect everyone. 
for the worse. It's like when Sephiroth shows up. Nobody wins. Uh, on a related note, if war is officially declared, it will not be long before borders start closing. So, if you've got somewhere to be, you might want to get a wee shuffle on. Eve? What the...? Sid? Hey, Sid? I heard you the first time. Just sit tight. Everything's under control. <laughs> <laughs> I said, just sit tight. This beauty's maintained by an expert and piloted by a professional. Y'all are in good hands. The game was basically telling me uh, this is a point of no return, no? You sure? Because I think that was the engine. Yeah. Uh, get off my ass and sit tight like I told you to. Oh, Lord. What was it? Altitude! We ain't screwed, people! Hey! All right! Brace for emergency landing! Oh, shit! <laughs> Is it because we're eight people? <laughs> okay, we're not gonna be able to go back to Nibelheim now. <laughs> what? Any landing you can swim away from? <laughs> you almost killed us! <sighs> <laughs> what is going on, dude? Shit, maybe I should have done the choco grass stuff before leaving. You're not Murasaki! <gasps> A golden key, chapter 12. Holy. So what are we waiting for? Repairing. Okay, let's start her up. What do you mean? <laughs> uh. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah, but the wings are still broken. And? What of it? Only one man has mastered the land, air, and sea. You're looking at it. You got that? Is okay, it gonna so? become a submarine? <laughs> so you can think of me as the captain of your ship. Strap on in and we'll punch through the chop. Aye, aye. <laughs> Let's set sail. I love Straight that they said the same thing. On the Costa del Sol. And after that, we hit it. Sounds like a plan. We'll be there before you know it. Let's set a course for Costa del Sol, sir. Roger that. Full speed ahead. Kate, what? mind filling us in on the Keystone before we arrive? Gladly. What? Well, 20 years back, one of my more eccentric colleagues convinced the company to build a museum for his antiques. The reliquary, they called it. Pretty cool, eh? Now, according to company records, the keystone was housed there. Wait a sec. I thought you said it was at the gold saucer. Aye, I'm getting to that. Did I fret? Where was it? Oh, right. So, the museum turned out to be a total flop. Closed as soon as it opened. But... Somewhere between cutting the ribbon and boarding up the windows, the keystone vanished into thin air. So it's not at the saucer? Do you know where it went? No, but I know a man who will. The former curator. Do you? Hmm? How do you know that? How uh, do you know that, Let's yeah? Just say, I've been around a while. After the museum debacle, all deal was devoted, only to be promoted again when the saucer took off. Made director in no time. A real richest to rags to richest story. All of which is why we're bound for the saucer. Hey, Sid, did I hear right? You used to work with Shinra? Still do, on occasion. The boys got their uses. That's gonna be a problem. 
You see, we don't take kindly to friends of the company. And I don't take kindly to that tone of yours. Man who tries to lord his power over me is gonna wish he didn't. <laughs> That's what's appealing about the skies. Got them all to myself. Rats can have their race in the gutter. Never much cared for the squeaking anyways. <laughs> I miss the wild blue yonder dearly. I... Uh... It's a fan fantasy game. It's fine. I will accept this um, turn of events. I hope Johnny's all healed up by now. And that his hotel's found its uh, sea legs. Fat chance. Kid probably got grifted again and is crying himself to sleep every night. <laughs> uh, here we go. Wow. <laughs> That's a weapon chest. Thank you for choosing Bronco Cruises. We sincerely hope but you enjoyed your trip like with usual. us. Cruises? I thought it was Bronco Airlines. Not after his wings got clipped. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> we really appreciate you ferrying us around. Yeah, that was uh, very well. helpful. Even though we almost died, you know, hey, but still. Y'all are headed to the saucer, ain't you? I might could tag along, take in the splendor. Vincent is gonna feel hot as shit. What do you think? Of course. Girl always knows just what to say. Am I right? <laughs> Shall we? <laughs> Wait a sec. Where's Vincent? Up there. Another loner. Mm. As if one wasn't enough <laughs> for pain in my ass. <laughs> yeah, one's more than enough. <laughs> You mean me? <laughs> <laughs> Did you not understand? Now that the tiny Bronco is able to cross the Meridian Sea, you can fast travel to any location. Okay. Whew. To board the tiny Bronco, speak to sit at the nearest port or select the vessel from the map screen. New quests available. The SRC declaration of war against Shinra's was the shot heard around the world and settling folks everywhere. Check the notice boards as soon as you travel to locations both old and new and see if anyone needs help from a hand for hire. Okay. The attractions at the Gold Saucer have undergone a series of renovations, as have many games available in other regions. Try revisiting familiar locations and seeing what new challenges await. Note that some mini games will not be updated in certain co until certain conditions are met. I see. What is that? Oh no way! Hey, Cloud, let me see that. New quests everywhere. What? <laughs> this reeks of sea salt. And not the fresh kind either. This thing smells ancient. Really? Yeah. It's like a pirate Vance map. told me about it once. Long ago, when most and, uh... folks spent their lives at sea, a war broke out between some pirates. I mean, how do you think they came up with Pirate's Rampage? It's based on a true story. It doesn't make sense how that the handle is hear? at the bottom, though. Yeah. Because it's supposed to protect here. <laughs> here. <clears throat> Anyways, I'm sorry. Gather round and hearken to my tale. <laughs> the four steel birds soared through the skies, and tracks wove across the land. Wooden ships were the primary means of I'm travel. I'm so happy that he has the his old voice ship now. Was crewed not Where by men, story. but monsters, hellions, the high seas. From the fires of war, these pirates emerged victorious, leaving crimson waters in their wake. World's oceans now his sole dominion. Their captain was declared the pirate king. As for the king's treasure, ere his passing, he took his most prized possession, quartered it, and sealed those pieces away, along with his four finest mates, to forever stand guard. 
Whatever he hid, this map should point us to the locations in which its fragments rest. The spell he used to seal them away seems to have broken as well. Though the Pirate King's treasure is now ours to seek, four ferocious fiends okay. stand in our way. Doubtless, we'll put up quite a fight. And I, for one, can't wait! Take to the open ocean with the tiny Bronco and follow the treasure map to recover the long lost relics of the Pirate King. Once you have assembled all four pieces, you can transmute a powerful accessory once used by this fable swashbuckler. <gasps> what? Huh? I... This one. <laughs> I am shook! Okay. Uh, we could do that. I don't know. There's so many things to do now. Wow. I want to go see Johnny. Hey, how about an orb or two? No, thank you. That Johnny's now it's open. Fixing this place up. Johnny's it's a seven men job at least. New vacation spot. <sighs> Rustic charm notwithstanding, I would have never stayed there. Got anything rare and exotic for me? That's that's nothing. Forty nine, eh? Wasn't I at forty four? God damn it! I um. I'm gonna go see about the, the notice board. To make tracks is on Choco back. Choco All passengers with I am shocked right now. Trouble in paradise. This is my solemn charge to keep our slice of beachside paradise free from all manner of unpleasantness. To that end, I employ a freelancer to resolve a simple matter, which they have failed to do in a timely fashion. And so I must once more seek outside assistance. It's time to deal with two problems. Rest assured, you will be well compensated. The mayor. Billy, gold cup or bust? Eh, hey, Cloud, if you're reading this, I haven't told you in person yet. We got permission to race in the gold cup. It's a major racing event and a real honor, believe me. When you're ready to challenge the best of the best, I'll be waiting for you in Chicago Square. Okay. Uh, Meridian Ocean. Okay, that's that's the pirate thing. I'm okay. Uh, nice. There's so much to do, but we can fast travel. So I'm just going to continue right now with chapter twelve. But next episode, we can definitely, uh... Should split up to look for Dio. Will do! If I catch you goofing off, so help me out. Uh. Um, we can definitely do odd jobs and, uh, pirate stuff and, uh, yeah. Holy. Uh, Cloud? You got a minute? There's something I failed to mention about the Temple of the Ancients. You might call it a legend or a warning. Okay. Uh-huh. You see, no one who goes into the temple ever comes out again. Oh. No one. And I'm wondering if you really want to take everyone to a place like that. You said it yourself. It's just a legend. I did, aye, but... Uh. Let's focus on finding Dio and the Keystone for well, now. Well, maybe Kate can go in uh, since he's an android. That's what he's gonna say. He's gonna... Oh, shit. Fast travel unavailable. <laughs> he's gonna be like... Hey there, 
Um, I'm, I'm, uh, I can't actually go in. I'm an android. Your trusty you know what I mean? So we have to go in every square to see We've arrived at your destination. if Dio is there. Battle square. I mean, why not? Is with me. <laughs> Listen up, combat hungry beasts of battle. I absolutely adore Our sanctum, oh, the oh, oh. Will oh. Host a spectacle for the There is. Director D. Check it out, Cloud. Will face the Can you believe this? No Corneo. fucking way. The door outstayed is welcome in Midgar. No. I decided to set up shop in the saucer. Great time, no. Eh? Interesting. There's an event being held at the Musclehead Coliseum tomorrow. If there's a dress rehearsal today, Dio might be there. We should check it out. No way. That Corneo is here. There he is. Well, that was easy. Aha, found him. Greetings, Mr. Director. Hmm. He doesn't look quite right. Uh, be careful. <laughs> oh, oh, he's beaten up. Well, if it isn't our friendly fugitives, you're looking hale and hearty. You're looking what broken up. I made a painful discovery that the Turks are stronger than the they look. Turks? You, sir, should know better. You're no spring chicken. Mm. Oh, yeah, because he was fighting Speaking when we went away. Things, okay, okay, okay. What happened to that wee That's keystone what happened. thingy? We need I to get our that. hands on it. Hmm. It was part of your collection, last we heard. Hmm. It was, yes. And in fact, still is. Point of order. My ancestors owned it. Uh. Don't you think that makes me its rightful owner? Hmm. A cetera, are you? That, my dear, is a bold claim. <laughs> but still, who am I to dispute your heritage? You may, of course, have the Oh, keystone. that was easy. That is, on one oh. condition. You must take part in our exclusive event, the fight for naming rights. Dio's champions versus the Corneo family. Should my team fall to those rogues, the gold saucer will become Corneo land. Oh, Lord. Flex it out. Training hard and getting those gains. What's up, party people? What's up? Mm -hmm. It's a challenge from the dark! Signed and notified! Not them. Take it in a team! Lord. But look at me. I can barely lift a finger. And here I was lamenting my lot in life when you came along. <laughs> All right, fate. then. Nay, divine intervention. Nay. <laughs> what say you? Will you what be my champions you? and go to war against Don Corneo? I'll do it. I'll fight. We win, we get the keystone. Right? As agreed. You have my word. Then we're in. Then we have ourselves a deal. Okay. <laughs> Naturally, I want you in peak physical condition for the big bout, so please use my hotel to rest up. Okay. Great. I'll jog on ahead and tell the others then. <laughs> and Aerith will fight with me. 
Rest at the haunted hotel. All right. The fate of the gold saucer rests on your shoulder. Your rooms are in order. Be sure to get a good night's. The fate of the gold saucer rests on your shoulders. <laughs> Don't let me down. God damn! I could have looked for him for such a long time. But it was not needed, after all. So there are new games, I think, for every game. New challenges for every game, right? Oh, Chadley. I can't wait to see who wins the contest. Chadley, what the Hello fuck? Hello there, Cloud. Are you enjoying yourself here at the Gold Saucer? Four years ago, the park underwent extensive renovations and was out. Oh, I think I heard today. that before. The Gold Saucer continues to expand. Oh, with new not them! In the works. No! Oh! That's new. Taking part in the main event at the Colosseum tomorrow. One of your comrades is hoping to spend a moment alone with Cloud later this evening. Cloud's relationship with his allies will determine how this portion of the story unfolds. If you wish to improve a bond with a teammate, complete any remaining odd jobs which features them before you proceed. You'd better rest up. I think I'm highest with. Tifa at the moment. Hmm, not now. I'm kind of busy here. So I'm good with that, to be honest. What is just huh? I'm still gonna save because that's scary. But uh, pretty sure my highest. How do you know that? Do you go in like party? You don't actually know. All that gore and more awaits you in tomorrow's gruesome match. <laughs> Best of luck to you tomorrow. I trust you. Knock him dead. <laughs> I'm gonna do the, the jobs and everything, guys. I just wanted to, um... <sighs> get a bit more what of the main happened? story going. idea you were into songwriting. <laughs> oh, I'm not. But I wanted to give it a shot. Songwriting? Well, good for you. Never know till you try. Hmm. Oh, Why is she oh. writing? Oh. <laughs> they say curiosity killed the cat. Eric! Ah! Gee! That was scary. So is Tifa going to spend the, the night? Not the night, but it, that time with me? <gasps> he goes in. He goes in the other Klaus body. 
when he sleeps. Which is really fucking weird. And Aerith did that too. When she touched the Mako livestream river with the gi. Some Zack time! Here. Cloud's all yours. I'll take care of Aerith after. Yes, ma'am. Sponge bath. Aerith sure does sleep a lot, huh? It's better this way. What? Why? Because of Cloud. He's still sick. Please. You gotta make Cloud get better. You gotta. I mean, I'd love to, but... You, uh... You said it's better for Aerith to stay asleep because Cloud's sick. Why is that? Because... She'll die if she wakes up. Oh, you think? What makes you say that? Uh. Promise not to tell? <sighs> when she wakes up, a scary man is gonna kill her. Huh? Cloud tries to save her, but he doesn't make it in time. He almost does, but he doesn't. She likes Cloud, so she's happy he came. Really, really happy. But... But... She dies. What the fuck, dude? That's why you have to make Cloud better. If he's sick, he can't save Aerith. Marlene. Are you sure you didn't just have a bad dream? When she touched no. her, I have goosebumps! I saw it. No oh, way, okay. she saw. <laughs> she worry. saw the future. One of the futures. With everything that's going on? How could I not? Okay. Just one question, if it's all right. Can you tell me what the scary man Sephiroth. looked like? Please? His hair was long. Mm -hmm. And gray. Uh. He knows Sephiroth. Of all the people... Zack, did you see? They're blooming. They are. Would you look at that? She's waking up. These were always Aerith's favorites. Yeah, follow them or something. The yellow flowers. This means she's going to wake up. <laughs> Maybe. And reunion Can always hope. means reunion, right? Hey, Elmira. I've got to go away for a bit. Need to talk to someone about Cloud. And who is this someone? A doctor? Well, he's, uh... Not Hojo. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Close enough, I suppose. You don't do that. No. Well, hurry on back, okay? It's hard enough looking after these two with your help, but without it... Without you, I'd be a wreck. 
Don't worry, I'm going by bike. Shouldn't take long. Just keep an eye on him while I'm gone, okay? Oh, and if Aerith does wake up, please don't let her leave. <laughs> no promises. That girl snuck out more times than I can count. <laughs> don't let her. Please. I won't. Oh my lord, I'm mind blown. <laughs> Dude. That was huge. Make sure that you're back by dinner. Make sure that you're back by dinner. That was huge. Holy! Eric touched Marlene and made her feel better and trust her. Just like she did with Red as well, with Nanaki, she touched him and then he knew things. So she did that with Marlene, showed her the, the future before we destroyed fate. So it's all the same in all timelines, right? Then we destroy fate. And now there's a chance of doing things differently. But Aerith is supposed to die by the hand of Sephiroth later. And Cloud tries to save her, but he doesn't succeed. That's what's supposed to happen. But now that Zack knows that and he's alive, maybe he'll be able to save Aerith himself. Or maybe we can give more time to Cloud, I don't know. But there's a way to save her, I guess. Is that why she said, like, right here? Was it here? Here? She said... Uh, don't fall in love with me, na na na, to Cloud, because she knew, she knew she was gonna die by Sephiroth's hand sooner or later. Now I think she has forgotten though, because the whispers take away her memories. Our, our Aerith in our timeline, she has forgotten that, pretty sure. So now no one knows that. So it could still happen in our timeline, in Cloud's timeline, basically. She could still die because no one knows that's gonna happen, right? But in this timeline, Marlene and Zack know. And Zack might tell Biggs, you know, whatever, but people know. So they can actually try and prevent that in this timeline. Or in the other timeline if there's a convergence. I am shook. <laughs> what? She's supposed to die? I can't handle. I would not be able to handle that. Marlene saw that. She's like, he needs to wake up before her to protect her. Shocked right now. I hope that Biggs will come to visit us soon. I hope that Biggs will come to visit us soon. Timeline is so fucked. That's crazy. So, 
Sephiroth must also know that he has to kill Aerith in some way, or did he will? So why is he more after her? Maybe it's supposed to be at a particular timing? Especially since she has the white materia and he wants the black one. Mm -hmm. I don't know, like it could be uh I thought about what you said. Couldn't stop thinking about it actually. Nice. About how, how it's up to each of us, us to find our own purpose in life. Cause an avalanche. I think I found mine. We don't have a whole lot of time. So tonight's gotta be the night. Do yourself a favor and steer clear of Reactor 6. <gasps> Take care. Biggs. No, I didn't... That's not what I meant! Shit. Gotta find Elmira. Fuck, 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 fuck. What? What? So does Cloud know a little bit of these things since he can go in the other cloud sometimes? <gasps> ah, I have so many questions! That's crazy! It doesn't mean she's gonna die in all timelines. Maybe she'll die in one. In like hours but not in the other one or something like that you know we still have we can still do something purifying air with prejudice or something like that right Ooh. Let's go! Doze off? No. The Deja vu. Marks say different. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You got me. <laughs> anyway, want to broaden your artistic horizons? Loveless is playing here. And I got us tickets. No way. Sure. After that, we could ride the Sky Wheel. Right. We missed out on that before. Yeah, but not this time. Let's go. <laughs> it's an eight! Oh my god. Girl. No way. I'm sorry, I'm just, I'm, I'm speechless right now. <laughs> I'm trying to think. See you again soon. Ladies and gentlemen, something big is afoot. I'm trying to think of everything that implies, you know, what we learned right now. Event. And away we go. Loveless like theater. Attention, our special showing of Loveless G edition will begin shortly. All ticket holders, please make your way to the theater. Yes, I've been seeing that poster ever since remake. Can't wait. Are you here to see Loveless? Obviously. We'll stop after that, guys. <sighs> But this Attention, is very exciting. Guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them Come bloom. on. Please speak to a member of the staff <laughs> at your earliest convenience. Thank you. <gasps> it's like VR. Attention, event square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Please speak to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention, event square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Congratulations. <laughs> she said I make them bloom, y'all. Would you like to sing it? Me? Uh, what? What is going on? This is so exciting. 
exciting. Is crying too. <laughs> I've never seen her look more beautiful. <laughs> yeah, she's a real star. Today's performance takes audience participation to the next level. With our revolutionary technology, you will become the hero of the story. Oh, only you can fell the Dragon King and win the princess's heart. Oh. mechanical metropolis built of blood, sweat, and gears. The city of Garya. An insatiable machine devoid of pity. Neighbors on all sides fell victim to its hunger while it grew larger and ever more powerful. The whirlwind of conquest swept up many, including him. Alfre was the traveler's name. In search of the goddess's <laughs> blessing, clown. he had journeyed oh alone. <laughs> He oh my god, he looks into good. The in the hope of becoming a hero, only to be flung in jail and branded a villain. There's no way, guys. There's no way. Test your might, sure. Oh, I love theaters. I love Oprah. I love... 
um, musicals. Join me in the dance. I love Jesse, so it was. This was really emotional. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, to time it or wow to you proceed to... or not to proceed no 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 let's uh let's uh dance with me I'm doing fine. I just I can do perfect. I can definitely not do perfect. I don't know how to properly time. These bars shall not hold me. I must fly free. It's not as soon as you see them, and it's not. Release me! My blade thirsts for vengeance. <laughs> this is so good. <gasps> it's Tifa. Oh my lord, she's beautiful. Fear not, Alfred. I've come for you. <gasps> Rosa, how did you find me? I sensed you were in trouble. Twas the will of the goddess, perhaps. I am gripped by this story. Ooh. Oh, are you the baddies? Barret and red? Pray take not another step, gentle princess. Wow. Varvados. It's Barbados? <laughs> oh, oh. Really? Would the cur defy his captor? We have a... A bangle, I think? I, by the grace of the goddess, as she has set me free, even wow. now, Nanakin so Black is amazing. She guide my blade. Okay. Pride goeth before the fall, and I, Garm, Garm. shall deliver you. <laughs> you know, Pride. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> You know not whom you face, nor that you stand in his dominion. For I am Barbados, the Dragon King. And by the draconic power that courses through my veins, I shall give you ample cause to rue this day. Pride goeth before the fall, and I, Garm, shall deliver you to hell. How shall your feeble Aegis fare? against piercing fang and keenest claw. Eee, I don't know. Uh, let's let's do Garm. I I want to do both. Can we do both? May mine infernal fangs find their mark. Okay. And taste of your flesh. I should wait. Oh shit. Wow. I thought I had to wait. I'm 
I'm sorry. I thought I had to wait, you know? Do it at the right time. Fuck. Had a lot to do great and good and... I don't know what's the difference. Shit. Goddamn. Bravo! What a splendid show! Never have I seen a swordsman dance with such grace and skill. The goddess must have seen fit to grant him a sliver of her strength. Perhaps his dreams of becoming a hero may yet be fulfilled. Now then. Ha! Hail and well met, noble Alfred. Though I am but a humble fool, some talent and divination do I possess. Fortune telling. Anything you wish to know, I shall gladly reveal. Your future with Rosa. Barbados's weakness. Uh, my future, of course. What is the future if not the product of choices past? Come on, Each I don't need the weakness. Fork in the road. None can divine the conclusion of every path. And yet. All tales that begin with a chance encounter share the same end. A tearful farewell. Well, that's enough of my blethering. Uh... It's time we set the stage in you. Of course, I wanted to know my lady's Tremble heart. And fear before the okay, mighty dragon I'm not gonna roar. try to time it. I'm just gonna try to have them all. Catch them all! Whoa, come on. Woo! Woo! No, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was looking at, at what's going on. <laughs> that was insane. Oh, come on. Lord. That was amazing. A truly remarkable display of swordsmanship. Enough to prove his heroism once and for all. He had been unjustly imprisoned. It looks so good. It's hard to not look at what's going on, you know? Alfred was resolved to press onward and reclaim the heavens. Now, without further ado... <laughs> I love this so much. Friends, lend me your ears. <laughs> Our aspiring heroes and indomitable princess's tale draws to a close. Only one act remains. Parting is indeed such sweet sorrow. But as they say, all good things must come to an end. Though it is our wish that this tale remain with you long after we are gone. So, my friends, will you join us in our conquest of despair? Let's go. Spectacular! Though our tale be loveless named, we may yet restore hope to this heartbroken world. Yeah, why is world. it called loveless, dude? The Dragon King Varvados fears only true love, and so our hero Alfred will reveal to him its power. He will go to his beloved and proclaim their blessed bond with a kiss. Now, Take stand off your before mask. your soulmate and let the world know your heart. Choose your 
beloved. What if you choose God? You can't, you can't save. It would have been so cool to choose Barret. My love. Alfred. Oh, that's so cute. The charade. Love is not what an illusion. What if I had picked you, Bear? <laughs> Barbados, I'm sorry. Ooh, ooh. Goddess above, ooh. let my blade strike true. All right, she's fighting with us, eh? Let's go. of wings and broken I can sign you to the abyss thank you Alfred for saving our world and everyone in it you are a true hero <laughs> give me that key <laughs> what awaits you at journey's end I wonder will the goddess grant you her blessing or will the flames of vengeance consume you all shall be revealed, O oh puppet of fate. So dance while you still have time. Dance to your frayed strings break, and you can dance no more. Alfred, look. Reminds me of Lies of P for some reason. Must you go? Those I hold dear are waiting. I don't understand. I cannot. But please be safe. Rest assured, I shall return. <laughs> you needn't promise that you'll wait, for I know that I will find you here. Wow! <laughs> Amazing! That was so good. Beautiful. Ah, oh, show stopping. We got an S at the end, by the way, I'm just saying. <laughs> I think maybe the blue ones were always gonna be good and the gold ones were always going to be... <gasps> Beautiful. Um, great. Maybe. Maybe there's no way to change that. I don't know. She's gonna sing. You got this. In city streets with worn cobblestones, listening to people rushing past to rhythms all their own. Life passing me by, not thinking how the years have flown. 
It's okay. <laughs> singing that is it um still eric's voice actress i don't think so but maybe it didn't sound like her but if so she has a crazy good voice like holy but i would have liked if it was sang a little bit more like her natural voice like it sounded like a completely different person but i might be wrong it's still really like it was beautiful, holy. <laughs> that was great! Yeah, yeah. Yes! Let's go! Deep end with Barrett. she could possibly die later I'm like I'm not okay <laughs> oh wow that was amazing yeah I can't wait to start bragging I'm friends with a famous singer well maybe next time you could take the stage <laughs> attention the sky wheel will be closing soon please line up and have your ticket ready 
Well, the night's still young, right? What say we check it out? Thank you for joining us for tonight's special performance oh, of that was Loveless. <laughs> if you'd like to continue the magic this evening, all our performances have concluded for the day. We hope to see you again soon. All our performances have concluded for the day. All right, we'll finish with the sky. <laughs> I can't hear any other thing. I repeat, who was that? For tonight's performance, just name the square, and I'll get you there. Please line up here to wait. Let's see, press the boat. Jesus, game. Why'd you gotta hit us like that? Okay. Okay. To embark on an adventure sure. Oh, we'll finish after this guy will, okay? <laughs> Let me save just in case something bad happens. <laughs> ah! Are you ready so to good. ride? That was, um. Wow. You ready for this? Truly. A gondola's here. Ah, oh, my beauty. Well, after you. You She's first. She's shy. Uh, Cloud? <laughs> Take my hand. Do you trust me? Ah! Look at that! Whoa, whoa! <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> I know it's gloves. <laughs> Think we can steer with this? Worth a try. <laughs> Here it goes. Oh, that's so fun. Oh, I'm so happy. Wow. Safe. <laughs> hey, over there, see that? <sighs> Being a jockey looks so fun. That's definitely not what the races are like. <laughs> I guess I'll just have to see for myself. You want to race? Maybe I can change character later. It's beautiful. Just like with the piano. So awkward. They're so shy. Come on. <clears throat> so, have you talked to Aerith? Oh, what about hmm? Zach? Hey, um, Aerith? She did. I talked to Cloud. He said he remembers Zach. <gasps> How they were friends five years ago. <clears throat> what? Not did, yet. Did, oh, okay. Right. Touchy subject, huh? You have no idea. Have feelings for Zach. I think it's a little more complicated than that. what I was saying last time when was that when was it that I said <laughs> it was a while ago I think 
it's more complicated than that because you have some some Zack in you cloud. So she kind of has feelings for you too because of that. I think that's what Tifa means. Hey, oh lord. It's kind of weird us being here like this. Isn't it? Why? No, it's cute. Is it? I mean, I guess it is. Kinda. Ever since we left Midgar on this crazy journey, ever since we were kids, even, I can't remember a time like this. A time when we were this close. Or am I getting ahead of myself again? Again? Yeah. Again. No, come on, Cloud, do something. I cannot handle this. Not one bit. <gasps> With the fireworks, I love you. Come on, that's too cute. Why are you shy now? We should probably head back to our rooms. Yeah, probably. Yeah, go back to the room, yeah. Get a room! <laughs> I'm sorry, I screamed a little bit. Can we just can we just pause for a second? Oh my god. Today is way too many emotions, okay? This is crazy. I can't deal. This has been remaking the making, okay? I've been waiting. Twelve years in Azkaban. <laughs> didn't know anything about this promised land. Ugh. But I do now, and seriously, wow, find of the century. You do? You never know. That intel could be bad. What? Our conclusions are based on a long-standing theory. It's safe to assume the temple and the promised land are one and the same. If the ancients headed there, oh, really? then it's gotta be the right place. <laughs> Good thing we let her go. I understand the keystone is to be awarded to the winners of today's special event. How should we proceed? I have an idea. That's why Cornell's there. Who's gonna compete himself, Rufus? All right. Let's bring this one home. Your battle party will consist of Cloud, his day, the previous night, and one member of your choosing. Once you and your teammates are prepared for the upcoming matches, speak with the reception staff.
Aerith would work really well too, I'm not saying, but uh Take a movie. Our sanctum, the muscle at Colosseum, will host a spectacle. I will stop here. This was a lot today. So yeah, I'm gonna stop here. And I've been I've been filming for a while too, so I was I don't know what I was expecting today, like but it was not this. <laughs> First of all, we learned a lot of new things. Uh, with Marlene and Zach, that was crazy. And then we got the Loveless, which was just incredible, incredible, incredible. I think this has been my favorite chapter so far. It's my favorite part. My last favorite part, I think, was the parade. This has just topped it. This was... I mean... Do I really need to explain? We got a kiss between Tifa and Cloud. Now I'm curious if you go on anyone else, like with anyone else, um, if you have like higher with with uh, Nanaki, what happens? You gonna date with him? Do they kiss? Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? What about with Aerith? Now I need to see. Would you guys be interested in like a reaction video? Maybe once I'm finished with Rebirth, I would love to see the other scenes with the other party members. If you guys are interested in that, I could do a reaction video of watching that, but... I mean, with Tifa, it was really cute. It was really sweet. I'm sorry, I'm moving like non-stop because I'm... I'm like hyper right now. I'm a little bit... Uh... I cried, I laughed, I was shocked, I, I had all the feelings today. Incredible game, just, just incredible chapter. Uh, <laughs> I don't have the words, honestly. Finally saw what Loveless is about. We saw Jesse, we saw Wedge and Biggs, and that, that made me... That really hit me in the feels. They really know how to hit you in the feels. That's, uh, that's definitely... <sighs> wow. I think I talked about my theories while I was playing, so I'm not gonna do a whole tangent now. I'm just gonna repeat myself if I do that, but... I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I really did. <laughs> this was amazing. And next episode we will go to the battle square and then I think I'm gonna try to do some odd jobs here and there, you know. I don't think I can do anything off camera right now. Yeah, fast travel is uh, unavailable, so that's fine. We can always do this and then maybe we'll be able to <clears throat> fast travel and um do other things you know do odd jobs and uh, then i'll be able to do some queen's blood off camera or such things you know but uh yeah incredible just incredible chapter so far we're not even done i can't believe we just kissed tifa that was crazy <laughs> And the promised land is the temple, maybe? What? Like, anyways, I, uh, yeah, we'll stop here, but hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!